Ahí no fue. Me pasó algo. Absolutely, we always take something away from every meeting we have. Oh, oh yes, yes. <laughs> Good <-o>. We're off. <laughs> We're off. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you. But for some American families, the wait is over. Ashley Bruggeman running into her family's arms in a New York airport, still wearing the same clothes she had on when she fled the Brussels airport. You know what you don't get very often? Marching baritones. Here's one right here. Plus, you know I love the tuba. It's one of my favorite instruments. Listen to this. He lost the microphone. He lost his mic down the down the tuba. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's not a tuba, by the way. It's, oh, what is it? It's a sousaphone. Oh, a sousaphone. Z Matki Bożej Strażniczki Wiary, Bedonia, Matki Królowej Polski, z Białej Podlaskiej, Świętego Antoniego, z Białej Rawskiej i Rawy Mazowieckiej. Ucioła, Świętego Rocha, Złap, Biłgoraja, Jerzego i Magdalena. You can log on to our website, NBC4i.com, and search the words, Dear Fans. Well, I haven't seen that yet, Jim. Nancy! But I hope my rack's better than yours, that's all I'm saying. Uh, you were speaking to Jim, of course, right? Jim, yeah. Yes. Uh, I was just talking to Jim over here, Jim. Yes, he was talking to you, Jim. So. I'm ignoring it. <laughs> play against the big boys, a team like the Carolina Panthers, a team that can really come line up and say, hey, you know what? We're going to come right here and right here, right in your mouth. <laughs> well, I don't know if they can play that kind of football. Oh, my God. Michael, what's up? Oh, what's up? Oh, get it. Yeah, get it, Walker. What? 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 <laughs> At the 2008 Beijing Olympics, it's fair to say a few people were shocked when they saw images of female gymnasts kissing on their TV screens. The gymnast in question was Russia's Ksenia Semenov, and following her routine, cameras caught her planting a mouth-on-mouth -mouth kiss with a fellow teammate. The images upset more than a few viewers, while others brushed it off as merely a European custom. Telling me just a little bit ago that this is New Jersey values joining up with New York values, adding this is big government, anti Second Amendment, pro choice. More importantly, though, this is terrible for Rubio. This aide continued, arguing that he cannot line up the establishment. That's the same argument that we heard from John Kasich's spokesperson, who essentially called this a nightmare for Marco Rubio. So the question now. When the ambulance came, was he still alive? Yeah, he was breathing. Okay, and was he still, you know, making contact and he sound clear? Did he say, feel like he was losing breath or anything? Yes, man. What did he say? He was like, now nah, all I heard was saying, help me, help me. I got to pee. Oh, that's what he said? I got to pee. Oh. I'm going to pee on myself. Do you know where he was shot at on his body? Um, I think in the arm and in, in the side right there. So he was shot on the arm, arm and his leg, or arm and his stomach? 
I just peed on myself. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry about it. But I'm wet. No, so um, afterwards, can you describe to people who don't know him? His name was Michael. You said. I think. Huh? I think his name was Mike. <gasps> okay, we'll be right back. The first Lord of the Rings movie. Unbelievable yes. surround soundtrack. Stuff. You got Dilda, uh, Bilbo coming from whatever his name is, coming, coming from behind you. <laughs> and you never Freudian want Bilbo there. coming from behind you. I'll tell you that right now, folks. That said, let me just stop before you dig yourself any deeper. Scare you perfect. You're always worth it. And you deserve it. The way you work it. Wesley presents, like a professional face in the Lord Jesus Christ. I now baptize you in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son. Hade du vetat om det här, men det är du inte. Du är intresserad av att samla in så mycket licensavgifter som möjligt, för det är det som är ditt jobb. Och det gör människor irriterade, aggressiva och upprörda, och det har de aldrig rätt att vara. Som jag försökte säga tidigare här, vi saknar inte de som har det. What are you doing with your phone? What? What are you doing with your phone? You just, you keep putting it underneath the chair. What are you doing with it? Why do you keep sliding it on the chair and aiming it at me? Uh, there is a crowd of thousands gathering here, some of whom are people who arrived here very early this morning. The earliest person to arrive around 7.45 or so is my new friend Charles. Charles, why did you come so early this morning, man? Uh, well, the reason why I come so early is just to celebrate Martin Luther King's birthday because I feel it's really good to come because, you know, because, you know, when Martin Luther King's birthday uh, uh, comes on January, I would say uh, it's important to always come and celebrate the great one of the King birthday because it really is important and it's good. Thank you very much, Charles. There are a lot of people who feel exactly the way Charles does and they've been doing so for decades here in Dallas. And like you said... During your relationship with Stacy, have you ever had sexual contact of any kind no, with a woman Lori. other than Stacy? You said no. no. A lot of detective tests determine you're telling the truth. <laughs> used a basketball to break into this house. Luckily, a neighbor was watching and called police. Well, I've never seen this happen before. So what the? Really afraid. 
Deputies say this morning they wanted to remain anonymous, helped them track down six teenagers, two of them girls, breaking into a home on Eagle Glide this morning. Yeah. So my dog uh, barking, and I, you know, I, um, I took a look from the window on the top. So, what are the languages do you speak? It's uh, very good. Yes, and do you speak other languages, despite Lithuanian or English? Uh, English. English. What was your biggest dream when you were a child? I don't know. Did you want to be a politician? No. No? No. So, why did you decide to be a politician? <laughs> no. I don't uh, say about politician, but uh, it's about uh, life or music, but no politician. Oh, really? <laughs>